So hello, my name is Warwick Bernard. I'm from the Czech Republic, and with my colleagues, we are working on something called uh, Version Press, which I'd like to briefly introduce. So basically, what we are trying to do is to um, connect two very important worlds. One is WordPress, obviously, and the other one is proper version control, uh, specifically uh, the Git version control system. So if you're developers, you probably use some kind of version control system for your project. And you probably also know that uh, WordPress sites are uh, typically quite hard to version control because of one thing, and the thing is the database. So even if you commit all the files to a Git repository, you still don't have uh, everything about the site in the Git repository. Uh, so, for example, if you just commit all your files and push it to GitHub and uh, pull to another computer and try to restore the site, you, you really can't because the database is not there in the repository. So, we are trying really to connect these two things and a version control everything about the site in a Git repository. Uh, the way we do it is that we mm, uh, track automatically every action that WordPress does. So, imagine if you edit a post or I don't know, change some option or install a plugin or update a WordPress core or anything, we, we make a commit after every such action and uh, you can undo every such action. So uh, the common problem, for instance, is when you update your plugins and the site is broken for some reason, uh, with WordPress there is simply an undo button, which is why we call it the undo button for WordPress. But if you know Git, uh, there's a lot more to it. If you have your site properly version controlled, uh, what we can do, for example, is to merge two databases, which is also something very, very difficult today. Uh, imagine that you have a staging site or a local development site where you develop some feature. It may involve file changes, database changes, and then you have a production site and you want to publish to it. Uh, the naive and Really, the only simple way to do that today is to just copy over the files, to dump the development database, and replace the production database with it. But imagine that there are some like new comments or new posts on the production site, uh, which you would lose by this. So it's really not easy today. And what version press can do, it understands what happened on the local site, and it understands what happened on the live site, and it can merge those sites together. So as an example, if you create a new post locally, and it uh, gets assigned some WordPress ID, and it, another post was created on the live site, and it, it got it got assigned this, uh, the same WordPress ID, like one, two, three, on, on both environments, uh, normally you would see a conflict, version press you don't because it understands those those two things are different entities and it will simply keep both posts on the live site. So we can do like this undo functionality is the very basic for common users, but if you're a team, you will be able to utilize all the nice features that you're used to uh, with your standard software projects. Uh, what is difficult about version press is it's technically very demanding and challenging to combine these two things that are naturally not very made to work with each other. So uh, this is a very young project. We have lots of challenges with third-party plugins, with common shared hosting, etc. But if you want to try it, uh, you can just write us an email, uh, info at versionpress.net, and I'll send you the current development build if you want to try it. So, and I'll be here during lunch, so if you want to talk to me about this, I would love to discuss your problems and how we could solve this with, with this thing. Thank you very much. Thank you.